Hello and a very warm welcome. I am Ruchi Sharma. Bitcoin mining hash rate has rebounded from recent lows and set a new all-time high, indicating high interest in blockchain mining. The metric tracks the total amount of computing power connected to the Bitcoin blockchains by miner. A higher value indicates new miners joining the network and older ones expanding facilities, while a lower value suggests some miners are disconnecting from the chain due to profitability issues. The metric helps control cryptocurrency inflation by controlling the block rewards that miners receive, which can be controlled by making the pace of mining harder or easier. The 7-day average Bitcoin mining hash rate had recently seen a significant drawdown reaching its lowest levels in over two months. However, since this low, the indicator has rebounded strongly, making a full recovery and setting a new record. The increase in hash rate could be attributed to the recent mining difficulty trend, which determines how hard miners find it to mine blocks on the Bitcoin blockchain. Jupiter, a trading platform based in Solana, has settled over $500 million in trades in the past 24 hours, surpassing Ethereum-based Uniswap version 3, the largest trading platform by volume. Jupiter has 550 tokens and over 5,550 trading pairs listed, with the USD coin Solana pair being the most active, with $166 million in volume. The platform routes orders to several Solana-based exchanges and executes the best available price for an asset when a trade is requested. The when meme coin issued last week by Jupiter developers saw about $150 million in trading volumes across two trading pairs. Jupiter's volumes leapfrogged Ethereum-based Uniswap's version 3, which saw $483 million in trades. Jupiter's JUP tokens are expected to be issued on Wednesday, with nearly 1 million Solana wallets qualifying for a slice of the airdrop. Traders expect the tokens to boost activity on Solana, similar to how a GTO airdrop preceded a meme coin frenzy in December. The Cello Foundation has announced that Circle's UST coin will be natively launched on the Cello blockchain network, aiming to increase Cello's use cases for real-world assets and enhance its services related to fiat currencies. USDC will join Celo's native token Celo while transitioning from Ethereum virtual machine compatible Layer 1 network to the Ethereum Layer 2 protocol. The Celo community will vote on a proposal regarding the use of USDC to pay transaction fees within the ecosystem. Circle is part of the regenerative finance movement focusing on carbon neutral and mobile first steps. The integration of USDC will provide corporate and enterprise users with access to Circle Mint on or off-ramp, enabling more activity on Celo. USDC is the second largest stablecoin project with a market value of $26.5 billion, following Tether with a market value of $96.1 billion. That's all in the story. Keep watching 3 TV for more such updates and do log on to our website www.3verse.tv.io or scan the QR code. This is me, Vishakha Thakur, signing off.